What's up guys, Iceman here, bringing Truly Desired on my channel for a Gears of War 3 dual commentary playing TDM on Thrashball, and this is actually a commentary where we're going to be talking over some of my gameplay, and uh, he's not actually in this match, but I figured for a commentary like this where we're actually going to talk about some engaging topics and, you know, really need to maintain a, a good conversation without getting interrupted by, you know, people killing you, it's hard to do live commentaries and talk about things like that, so... Um, basically I'm bringing him on my channel, he just started a new Gears of War 3 team called Truly, and he's trying to get his name out there, and um, you know, I'm just trying to help out the Gears community, and uh, bring on a new person and uh, introduce his team to the community, so uh, when did you first start recording, man? I, I first started recording about, I want to say four months ago, uh, I, I finally got my Aver Media uh, not too long ago, and uh... I've seen a lot of uh, people recording on YouTube and whatnot, and I've always wanted to do it, but it's just been uh, mainly the problem of money, so I finally got the money for it, so yeah, I thought it would be pretty chill to actually start doing what I love doing, playing Gears, and posting how good I am. Yeah, well that's you know exactly how it was for me. I started out um, you know, getting into the hobby because I saw other people on YouTube doing the same thing. And it was a game I played, you know, I got Gears of War 1, and I saw people like Nismo Joe and Angel of Evil and Shadow Punisher posting gameplay, and, you know, I told myself I could do that, and I could do it better. So I went out there, and, you know, I got a capture card, and, you know, I just started recording myself, and here I am today, and, you know, people caught on. So, um, you said you got the Aver Media. how much does that cost? Aver Media is about um, one ten. I got it at GameStop for uh, okay. an online discount. Is it HDMI or just regular like component? It's regular component. Okay, yeah. I had the PVR one that was regular component, and the Elgato is actually HDMI. The quality is pretty crispy. I don't know. I'm, this is actually HDMI quality that you guys are looking at right now. I'll render it out in like pretty good quality so you guys can full screen it and uh, not see any pixelation. But so, how many people do you have on your roster right now for your team? Um, we have 17 people right now for a roster. I have about um, eight people doing GB right now, and about another six doing a recording right now. But we are always looking for more recorders. Um, oh, yeah. We are all. We are also looking for editors and everything. You know, just like the basic start out team right now. I feel you. I feel you. So, you got about you said six recorders. Yeah, and, we're low on that. And right now you got like in kind of like an editor in training. He's got a guy on the team learning how to edit by uh, Chaos Uzi. Uh, he was nice enough to help this guy out. So basically, you know, for a team that's trying to make it out there and get their name out there, they definitely need editors. So if any of you guys would be, you know, willing to edit for them or, you know, join their team as an editor, that would be great. Um, just send uh, him a message. His link will be in the description. And uh, what else? You need players as well, but uh, yes, he definitely need needs editors players. right now. But um, for the most part, about half his team is GB players, like you said. So I doubt. Do any of them have capture cards? Maybe one. Uh, about two to three. Not not that many. Oh, okay. So and they're ma they're mainly like recording like the matches and stuff in the GB, right? Yeah. Not oh. many going for clips. Right. Yeah, because it's definitely hard to get GB clips, man. I remember I tried to do it, and I think I only hit one, like, ever, just because everybody's playing so laid back. So what are your plans for Judgment? What are, you, are you trying to get out any uh, montages or anything like that? When Judgment hits, yeah, I want my team to be out there, you know, putting out content. Um, I want to be that first team that puts out content so people are looking up our vids. You know, I think that was that would be, like, the main breaking point for us, you know. Oh, yeah. Was, uh, go ahead. Uh, starting out for like maybe putting out standards for the uh, the new game and maybe basing it off of that. Yeah, I feel you. But you got to look at it as basically that's everybody's, you know, Nova, Ray, uh, all these other teams. I don't even know if Onyx is still a team. I'm not sure. No. I don't stick up with that. Oh, but um, who else? Fucking Essence, uh, Avenge. Like all of them are going to be like, all right, guys, we need a team Taj out now. We need, uh, you know, everybody record all night. We need a team tie shot by tomorrow. So, basically, it's going to be hard for you to still get your name out there. But, you know, maybe if you get some recorders and some players, you'll be able to make that team touch happen. And if it's good enough, then um, you'll definitely get your name out there. Because you got to know that coming from, like, nothing and trying to make it to something is hard when you're posting content that is, like, 
not crazy or good quality or you know if it's standard def or you know is, are you guys only going to have like hd capture cards or like what right now yeah i'm um, i'm being very picky about who i let in on my team because that's good uh, though yeah i need to i need to be persistent with the people i need to you know throw it down on the law of what my team is like i'm not gonna let anyone just in my team i like like the standards like you were talking about yeah. yeah if you're gonna make it you gotta have the standards of the other uh competition you know you gotta either like even out and kind of um you know stay even with the competition or outdo the competition which would be really hard to outdo teams like you know avenge and essence and all these big teams because they have so many players and you know really good editors so right now you're probably like thinking you're really overwhelmed and you know it's you got a, like a long road ahead of you but you know within like six months you, you might really have this team going it's definitely going to take a while it doesn't even think like it doesn't even feel like we've been in, in chaos for like two years almost but uh you know it's actually been two years it blows my mind you know time flies by man but um let me think judgment i mean your whole team's of course getting judgment right of course. Yeah, that would make any sense for them not to. I don't even know why I asked that. Um, so, do you guys have any, uh, you know, plans to do any like event? I don't even know if they're gonna do events in Judgment, like event tages, like I know Boom Snipes tages, or like um, enter in any. I know we're doing Clan Wars. That would have been a good thing for you to do. Enter in the Clan Wars for Judgment. We're gonna hold this thing called Clan Wars, which means uh, all the teams in the community that enter get ample time to record about two weeks to record and get all the clips together um we just did one on the fps sub channel that i run for the community channel and i believe um nova might win that i'm not sure in my opinion they won but basically the team puts together a montage in two weeks and the community rates on who had the better touch so it's kind of like an engaging you know community activity that brings everybody together all the teams and it's definitely a good idea, so I'm definitely going to do that on the FPS hub. So, I mean, if you got your shit together by judgment, um, I'll put you down on that list so you guys uh, can... I hope uh, to have uh, my members be doing that. Yeah, that's my plan. That would be definitely, uh, like, a good thing for you to um, do because I'm going to be promoting it. And once, you know, they say, oh, Truly, you know, is entered in the competition or Truly versus Nova or Truly versus, you know, Essence or Avenge. I don't even know if Avenge or Essence are going to do it. Hopefully they will. I know we uh, United We Stand is something uh, Calx is doing, which is pretty much like a community Taj with all the Gears of War teams. So I think uh, that's why Chaos didn't enter in the competition this year and Avenge didn't do it. But, I mean, this year I meant like for uh, the most recent one we did, but we're definitely doing one on release date. I think I'll post a video log a couple days before the game comes out just talking about it, saying like, look guys, um, each team's gonna have to use, you know, classic Baird, and the other team or the lo you know, there is no more Locust, so uh, your primary weapon has to be your shotgun or I don't know, it's just something to. There is no clan tags, so we can't tell if they're old clips or new clips. But since we're doing it on release day, we'll know if they're new or not. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So we probably don't even need to do a specific character for the release date one, but later down the road we will for sure. I uh, need to do that. Um, would you like to add anything in there? Or just talk about anything? Or you uh, just keep asking you questions? Yeah, you can just keep asking me questions. I feel you. All right. Let me let me ponder some questions right now. All right, I got a question for you. How about you said you needed players and editors, but do you need graphic designers for your team? Yes. Yes, we do. All right. So if you guys are, you know, any... You know, smaller, you know, graphic designers out there that aren't on a big, bigger Gears of War team already, you know, that would like to start on a new team that, uh, you know, kind of has a low sub count and make your way up with the team, then you guys can send the team channel a message, which I will put in the description. So, what exactly does it take for a person to be in your team? Well, um, for the people that do submit clips, uh, I was looking for persistence and, um, basically high standards like um, an active you know member that's on every day at least yeah. for a little bit to get those clips and someone also on every day. and someone you know not necessarily that you know after a bad game might go into the you know game chat and talk shit so you want kind of like a drama free environment for your team 
I don't want no drama in my team whatsoever. You got a problem with a member or you got someone that you just don't like, you got to confront me first. I, um, I'm i pretty strong when it comes to leadership. I do not want to be disrespected. Um, so basically when it comes down to it, I want people to uh, just respect others in the, the, in the community. So yeah, so if you ever had a problem with someone, um, hit me up first. That's that's basically what I want to happen. So we have we have something clean and respectful set up. So there is no trash talking. I feel you, man. That's exactly how a lot of teams crumble. Is because you know one team member will join a team with his best friend, and then somebody will get in a fight with his friend, and that guy's friend will come in, and then they'll both leave together and bring their friends with them too we had a, a lot of shit like that happen in chaos a lot of drama but we um in, in the chaos clan also have a rule for new recruits i'm sure every chaos member will vouch what i'm about to say is that you know when, when you get recruited we give you the rundown of like no shit talking um in uh public games no shit talking in the game chat i mean and uh you know just you know keeping everything respectful because once you're in the the eye of the community and people start judging you and you know you want good things to be said about you not like yo i know who that team is they're a bunch of fucking dickheads like yeah you know they raped me yeah but they didn't have to go in game chat and like you know gloat about it but uh this gameplay is wrapping up man um is there anything that you would like to say to the viewers um i would like you guys to check out my channel um please uh make a comment on my random clips below um i i have just started recording i would like to know you guys opinion on it uh see what i can make content better uh maybe render settings i'm running on sony vegas 10 and a good template for me would probably be a good advice and just basically what can i do to put my team up uh better for you guys all right man well thanks for coming on buddy Later, guys.